got some good news. Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine is looking very promising. The company says it's 95% effective. Pfizer has chosen Tennessee to test distribution of this vaccine. The company plans to file paperwork for emergency use as early as Friday. And studies show COVID-19 has greatly affected minorities, especially the black community. Now a group of doctors want to make sure when a vaccine's ready, it is very safe. Mo Hyders live for us downtown. Mo, what is this group doing to really make sure people trust this vaccine that they can take it early? Yeah, hey there, Ben. Well, the group, the National Medical Association, is conducting their independent vetting of this COVID-19 vaccine. And a lot of progress has been made so far. So here's what's been going on. So far, they've had two meetings with Pfizer, and there's a third one in the works as well. They've also met with Moderna and AstraZeneca. The association's president said they've held meetings for a while and are hopeful they'll agree with the decision the FDA makes. Even though the FDA has final approval of a vaccine, the National Medical Association wants to make sure they play a part in it before it's ready to go. They're already suffering more than other communities, and we would hate to see that suffering gap widen because members of our community did not elect to receive a vaccine that could have prevented uh, kidney disease, prevented uh, lung damage uh, from COVID-19. And also, Meharry Medical College CEO Dr. James Hildreth pointed out last night that trials of both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines had, quote, a less than ideal reasonable enrollment of minorities as hoped. Excellent science is the answer. Now, this, keep in mind, this is also important because Dr. Hildreth, of course, has been vocal about how COVID-19 has affected minority communities.